This is one of my favorite songs. Let me lower it a little bit. God is in this story. God is in this story. Just torn of pages in this book. Words that tell me I'm no good. Trapped inside to find me for so long. But the hell, I don't know the rest of the words. Dust it off and get me up. Never gone. God is in this story. God is in the details. Even if the road he owned my heart, he never parts. When I'm at my weakest, I will trust in Jesus. Always in the highs and lows. God is in this story. I'm learning it. You can sing to God and still have a great, you know, a great life and not be like, you know, insane about religion and stuff. I do love God. He's given me a great life. And my life is going in some nice directions. So, uh, listen to this song. God is in this story. God is in the details. I don't really know the words yet. When I'm at my weakest, I will trust in Jesus. want to check it out it's um god is in this story it's a cover by the mccoy sisters check that out he's like disease he's the one who raises the he's a healer wish i knew the words That's a hot song. You know why it's a hot song? Because God is good. God has given me, you know, there are days that I feel, you know what I mean? Like, I'm, I'm going to have a little talk with you, okay? There are days that I just feel like, what's the point, right? But I can't think like that, right? I can't think like that. God has given me a beautiful life. With all my fears and all the things. God has given me a beautiful daughter. Oh God, sometimes I swear. This teenager, she's going to kill me. But um, she's given me a beautiful daughter. She's given me a beautiful mother. She's given me an amazing father. Um, an amazing mother. Um, I have some people in my life now that oh my god that's another story for itself babies but you know i got some people's um i got a couple of good friends and i got some people's that are just boy and i just love 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 you know but you know my my life is going in better directions you know i'm seeking therapy now i am I'm going to really start working next month and 
the beginning of October, actually Monday. I just kind of like worked a couple of times. I'm a substitute teacher, but I'm really a singer, as you guys know. But um, you gotta make gotta make some cheddar for uh, me and Violet Rose, and um, so I'm gonna really work on the whole month of October. I almost have every day filled, and I have um, half of November filled, a couple of days in December already filled, and one day in January. But um, and as the days go by, there's an app, and I can just look and see you know what I can grab but anyway I'm going off on a tangent here I just want I was listening to that song and it just it just gave me this feeling that I do love God and I do believe in God and sometimes when you least expect it your life goes in some awesome beautiful directions whatever that direction is gonna take me I'm um, I'm gonna I think I'm gonna be okay you know I've been through a lot the last five years the last five years have been um, hard, trying, terrible, and then also emancipating, freeing at the same time. My anxiety levels have gotten to an un, um, you know, this is just another little sidebar. My anxiety levels have gotten to a unmanageable level at times, um, but um, that's why I need to seek therapy to talk about stuff and sort things out um, because I generally am a funny, fun, happy-go-lucky person. And I want to continue on the vein. I just worry so much. And I know people can relate. Like, this is a mental health issue. My mental health is compromised sometimes. And I'm such a fun, funny, beautiful person I don't want to feel like that anymore, you know? I really don't. So, on that note, I'm going to go upstairs. I'm going to chill. I'm going to watch a movie. I don't know which movie yet. I think I'm going to watch either The Green Mile. I could watch that over and over again. Or um, City of Angels. That's one of my favorites. Or, I don't know. And I'm going to have some chicken, some Brussels sprouts, a little salad, and just chill. And hang out with my kid. Alright? So, I love you. You know I look good. I mean, come on now. Y'all know. Now this, no makeup, no filters. You know why I don't have wrinkles, right? I wear glasses all the time. My mother always said, wear glasses even in days where the sun is not out. So you don't do that and squint and stuff like that, so... Sounds like I'm talking vanity and stuff, but when you look good, you look good. But anyway, other than that, I love you. Did I tell you that today?